The recently introduced 2023 Explorer for the People's Republic is what Ford prefers to call American sophistication meets Chinese elegance. Although the midsize SUV is advertised as being completely new, it is actually only a significant improvement for the existing version. Right away, we can see that the front grille has been significantly bigger, heavily chromed, and is surrounded by completely reworked LED headlamps. There are other improvements in the back where the bigger taillights are modeled by those of the smaller equator, which is also available in China. The side profile exposes 21-inch alloy wheels with a turbine fan design. The Ford emblem has been replaced with prominent Explorer text on the tailgate, and the blue oval is now positioned slightly lower between the taillights. It is connected by a wider and thinner chrome bar than before. The interior has seen the most significant changes, with the dashboard now containing a massive 27-inch touchscreen similar to that found on Ford Evo sold in China. Naturally, the large display has swallowed the majority of the conventional buttons, and in order to create room for the XXL screen that spans the passenger side of the dashboard, the central air vents have been lowered. Will the North American version see these changes? According to Ford Authority, the changes will only be made to the Chinese Explorer. The US model for the 2023 MY will essentially stay the same. On August 11, the domestic market order books for the SUV are expected to open, and production is expected to begin on November 7. The all-electric Explorer is still going on, but the planned launch date of mid-2023 has been moved to December 2024, when production is supposedly set to begin. The more opulent Lincoln Aviator EV is in the same boat, both must travel on a special EV design. Although it is currently unknown, it is unlikely that the two zero-emissions SUVs will be constructed in Chicago or Kuwaitlan, 